Hey everyone, it's Rag here and welcome to another video. I know I have been gone for a long time and the videos have been really inconsistent but it's all because of some IRL issues and I have exams coming up as well. So yeah, after that I will be posting consistently and yeah, just look forward to that. Anyhow, inside of this video I will show you the best and easy method to optimize your windows whether it be 10, 11, 7 or even Windows XP, well maybe not the XP, for the ultimate gaming and performance using a simple utility that has every tweak and setting you will ever need for your windows optimization built into it and all you need to do is just simply click some buttons and don't use your fucking mind well because you don't need to use your mind because it has everything just laid out for you and you just need to use it this utility was actually developed by our team and has everything that you will need to keep your games running smooth before jumping into the video just take a quick second to leave a like so that the video can reach more people and help them too with their pcs and now let's dive straight into today's video so as I have already mentioned, this utility is going to give you everything that you will need to optimize your windows because this is going to be optimizing your CPU, your memory, your storage, your GPU and everything in between. This utility is not free of course because it has provided everything for you but trust me it's really worth it. It only costs 24 euros and you have the lifetime access to the utility along with every future updates. So you just need to buy the license simply once. For a lifetime license and 24 euros. I think it's pretty good and I will be showcasing it inside of this video of course. So in order to get this all you need to do is go down into the description of this video and join the discord server and once you are here all you need to do is open up the purchase section and then go ahead create a ticket and the staff will then guide you along with the process. Uh, it's really simple and easy they will give you everything that you will need to log into the utility and even if we have the 24 7 customer support. So if you run into any issues you can always go ahead and ask for help inside of here. So so once you have downloaded the utility, what you need to do is just extract it and then we are going to be going ahead and running it, right clicking on it, run it as administrator and then the utility should pop up. Now of course for me I don't need to log in, uh, however for you it will ask you to log in and then you need to go ahead and provide the details that were provided to you after the purchase of the utility. So once you are logged into the utility it should be something like this. Now obviously these are the basic tweaks which are basically the enable classic alt tab which if you didn't know this is the alt tab so yeah it's gonna go ahead and enable the classic alt tab then there is also the enable msi mode then there is the enable full screen exclusive which everything is just applied with a single click apply win 32 separation value it applies the 26 one and if the 26 is already applied it's going to revert that to the default uh, so i'm gonna go ahead and apply the 26 once again then there are visual tweaks which basically goes ahead and tweaks all of the windows visual settings and hence giving you a performance increase inside of your windows then moving on to disable fd yet which goes ahead and disables the fault tolerant heap and then there is the import custom power plan which imports the swift power plan you can go ahead and check it by going into the power options so if i go ahead and open up the error power plan go inside of here as you can see there is the swift tweaking utility power plan and all you need to do is just go ahead and click on it and voila that's basically what you need it performs its function just like it says provides optimal frame times and latency then there is the disable mitigations which basically goes ahead and disables all of the process mitigations um, and once they are successful disabled you just need to go ahead and click ok then there is the disable windows updates mouse tweaks tweak windows settings and then there is also the bcd edit tweaks and all of this can be applied by just single clicking now this is stuff that would normally take a lot of time which i am sure a lot of you already know then there is also the things like placebo and what's actually good for you but inside of this utility everything that is provided is actually good for you and it's going to go ahead and help you get the maximum performance out of your computer then moving on to the advanced tweak it has the priority tweaks then the usb tweaks power tweaks scheduler tweaks memory storage disable dma remapping disable windows defender kernel tweaks services tweaks even delete microcode and driver tweaks so you can go ahead and apply all of these one by one once again by just simply going ahead and clicking on the button and it's going to go ahead and apply that change for you then moving on to the network tweaks it goes ahead and apply the best network adopter settings apply hit reg tweaks disable auto tuning oh yeah and there is the warning if disabling auto tuning can go ahead and reduce the buffer bloat but it can also significantly decrease your network speed so if you are someone who likes to keep that in check then maybe this one is not for you you can always go ahead and click no then there is the, also the static ip this one is a personal preference as well so if you have any issues with this you can always go ahead and reset it to a dynamic ip which a quick google search will get you there or even you can go ahead and ask that on the discord server it's really simple really easy if you ever want to switch back to dynamic ip 
However, these are all of the network settings and then there are the Nvidia settings and moving on will be the AMD settings. So for the Nvidia settings, it applies all of the best Nvidia profile settings, basically the control panel and some of the hidden settings as well. Then the applies hidden registry tweaks, unrestricts clock policy and set real display scaling. These are all of the tweaks that I highly recommend you to go ahead and apply. Even if you are not using this particular software, I would still recommend you to apply these tweaks. So yeah. Then for the AMD settings, basically a lot of the similar things. In the Nvidia section, most of these were applied through the NIP. However, for the AMD, we're going to be going ahead and applying one by one from here. If you ever have any questions about one of these settings, you can always go ahead and ask them on Discord and the people there will get back to you. So yeah, that was a quick rundown on this utility. So basically, there are a lot of the basic tweaks, the advanced tweaks, the network, the GPU tweaks for both Nvidia and AMD. And that is basically all for now. Also, this folder that comes along with it just contains some of the resources. So yeah, that's that. You can go ahead and close out of the utility. Go ahead and restart your PC and you will be able to feel the difference inside of the performance on your Windows. Alright, some final remarks or conclusion about the program. Now I know that the program isn't free and there is a reason for it. The developers took a lot of time and it also took a lot of effort from the developers to develop this program, which I'm sure that all of you are already aware of. Putting this much time into a utility is not actually viable if that makes sense without making it paid because the developers also need money which i'm pretty sure all of you already know again other than that do i think that this is worth it absolutely yes is it because that i am a part of it well maybe i am kind of biased on this uh, however still if you wanted my honest opinion then if you have the time to learn all of these tweaks and do them by yourself then i would always recommend that you can always go ahead and get that knowledge and then go ahead and replicate it on any machine you want however if you don't have the time to learn every single thing and also apply all of those which trust me takes a lot of time then i think this is absolutely perfectly for you uh, this is not only for the increase in performance but also the decrease in system latency which i am sure that the competitive players know how important the latency is along with that there is the ping advantage as well it's going to decrease your ping with the network tweaks as well so yeah all of that combined i think it's really worth it and for a lifetime license 24 euros is a good investment in my opinion inside of this program so yeah that's it in order to get this program once again all you need to do is join the discord server the link will be in the description go into the purchase section and create a ticket and then the staff will guide you through with the whole process and if you have been watching this far then thank you so much for watching it really means a lot to me make sure to leave a like and share this video with anyone who might require it in order to just you know help them and yeah with that i guess i'll see you guys in the next one hopefully soon until then, stay awesome.